know. Your father and I talk about these things, so don't try to place against each other. I gotta try. It's what I do. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Is uh, Alan here? Father Huggy Bear. Yes, my child. You've got company, Alan. Stop him! Stop him! Stop him! Okay. You must be Jake. Uh-huh. And you must be Jake's grandma. Judith, hi. Why don't you go watch some cartoons? Okay, cool. <laughs> Are you proud of yourself? Me? Oh, please, she has to be half your age. Oh, that. Yeah, I am pretty proud of that. <laughs> What could you possibly have in common? What do you talk about? Talk? To tell you the truth, we haven't really done a lot of talking. I mean, I, I did hear her confession. She's been a very bad girl. And I'm supposed to leave Jake here? What kind of message does that send him? I don't know. Dreams can come true. Life is beautiful. There is a God. Hey, Jim. Father? Mm. I suppose you're the one that introduced Alan to that slutty little... Don't say it, Judith. You'd just be demeaning all women. And yes. Figures. Well, I don't want her around my son. Uh, oh, really? So do I get to screen the men that you're dating? And, and let's not forget, I know about that guy who delivered the truckload of sod. What about him? It doesn't take two months to put down a new lawn, Judith. <laughs> Sounds like she got laid before the sod did. <laughs> Dignify that with a response. Watch out for crabgrass. 